Klimt would become known as a painter of women. Women both in a mythological sense and a symbolist sense, as well as of society women, such as the female figure in Dame in Fauteuil. It's that idea of celebrating female beauty and also a very veiled sexuality. Dame in Fauteuil was painted in 1897-98 by Gustav Klimt. It depicts a fashionable, unidentified sitter in a beautiful crimson day dress and matching hat. The female figure is placed in profile against an ambiguous background of dark brownish reds and a taupe. She's sitting in a chair and her waist is belted in a sort of shock of green color, which contrasts with her red dress and hat, which are beautifully painted in great detail. There's a softness to her face, which almost glows from the canvas. The symbolism of the two faces at the upper left corner isn't fully understood, but they seem to allude to the ambiguity of the space that the female sitter is placed in. Adding to the mystery of this work is the fact that we just don't know who the sitter is. This is the first work that Klimp executes in a square format. This is a format he would use for almost all of his most famous compositions, including The Kiss and The Portrait of Adele Blockbauer, also known as The Woman in Gold, and all of his landscape paintings. Damien Fauteuil is painted in 1897 to 1898, which is the same year that the portrait of Sonia Nips in the Belvedere in Vienna was painted. They're both square in format and feature women in similar styles of dress, although the portrait of Sonia Nips has a light pink as opposed to the crimson red in the present portrait. The location of Damien Fauteuil was unknown for quite a long time because it was in the same collection for over 100 years. It was acquired by that family from the artist directly and remained unseen until 2001. This is only the second time it's appeared in public since 1898. This portrait is right at that moment when he and the other young artists in the Viennese Secession break away from the traditional school. It's a moment of complete and total change in Vienna. This picture is very emblematic of where he had been with these very traditional portraits and where he's going. <laughs> 